So what is WooCommerce? WooCommerce is an e-commerce platform designed for WordPress and was created in September of 2011. Uh, now, having worked with hundreds, if, if not more, of e-commerce clients, um, it's been a while since I've been this impressed with the e-commerce platform. Um, I'm going to explain to you uh, the benefits of WooCommerce um, and what it means to you for as a business owner, as well as answer many of the common questions that our clients have had uh, for us. So there are three primary benefits that I want to touch uh, base on with uh, WooCommerce. The first is that it's very easy to use, both for your customers and yourself. Uh, second, it's easier to develop on than uh, many of the other e-commerce platforms out there. And third, there are tons of support as far as e-commerce logistics for WooCommerce. One of the awesome things about WooCommerce is the fact that it's very easy to use, both for your customers and for you. Um, on the front end with the uh, your customers, the checkout process and the My Account section, all that's very intuitive. And what I like about it is with the checkout, it's a one-page checkout. Basically, you don't want to have any uh, barriers between uh, your customers uh, and them purchasing your product. So the one-page checkout is a lot more user-friendly than some of the other cards that I've seen with multiple pages to uh, check out. Uh, and also, the backend is really intuitive as well. Um, WooCommerce was actually created by a team of user interface guys versus some of the other cards like Zencard, for example, was uh, created by programmers. So sometimes something as basic as updating your products or changing uh, something that otherwise would be pretty um, straightforward um, is actually not in uh, some of these other uh, cards versus with uh, WooCommerce, everything is streamlined and also since it integrates with, uh, with WordPress, um, you don't have to learn two separate software uh, and you don't have to deal with two separate logins, one for your website and the content management system for that, and also one for your e-commerce. With um, WooCommerce, everything is seamlessly integrated together, which is really nice. One of the things that I really like about WooCommerce is from a development point of view, it's a lot easier to develop on and it's a lot less work. Uh, so what does that mean to you as the business owner? Well, because the amount of work um, compared to, for example, Magento, you're looking at a uh, double if not more amount of work to get a fully featured uh, and fully working e-commerce platform versus WooCommerce. So essentially, you're paying a lot less uh, with WooCommerce to have a fully working e-commerce website. And also, because the development uh, process is, is, um, requires less hours to develop, to develop your initial website will be built a lot faster as well as any kind of upgrades uh, that you'll need in the future uh, that tends to be a lot quicker and of course um, time is money and one of the other things I really like about uh, WooCommerce is that um, it's very lightweight compared to some of the other platforms uh, again like Magento for example so on the same web hosting account your uh, e-commerce website built on WooCommerce is going to load a lot faster than Magento and uh, for your customers you basically want as little loop, uh, hoops to jump through as possible you don't want your customers to have to wait around for pages to load and potentially leave your website so that's another benefiting factor of uh, WooCommerce now on to the fun stuff uh, with WooCommerce um, out of the box uh, you can have simple products uh, meaning like a hat or a guitar. Uh, you can have uh, configurable or variable products, meaning like a shirt, dresses, where you may have different sizes, different styles, uh, variations, different colors. Um, you can have um, virtual products, for example, like a service or maybe a gift certificate that you're selling. Um, downloadable products, for example, like an ebook or MP3. You can even have external links as products. So for example, if you uh, are using Amazon Associates or eBay, you can actually afford them to your field link. And all this is out of the box with uh, WooCommerce. Um, it also comes with advanced uh, reporting, inventory management, um, comes with coupons, discounts, basically everything that you would expect from a powerful full-fledged e-commerce software. Um, now that's just the out-of-the-box stuff. They also have um, just a ton of 
premium um, extensions and these extensions are basically plugins for uh, WooCommerce if you will uh, one of the things about uh, WooCommerce is the way they make money is actually off the extensions the average extension I would say costs seventy nine dollars and what I tell my clients and uh, I wholeheartedly believe this is that I rather have my clients especially if they're you're making money directly from your website um, you know pay for the plugin be, uh, versus trying to find something free that a lot of these other open source softwares have free uh, plugins for um, because when you pay for uh, for something um, the quality of service is a lot higher the quality of the product is a lot more robust so from my experience working with just tons of different e-commerce platforms in the past five six eight years um i always find that the paid plugins are a lot more reliable than the free ones uh and within this marketplace um you can have support from anything you know fedex ups dhl any kind of this uh you know the shipping logistics any kind of payment uh, gateway logistics stripe.com uh, authorized.net um, you can even have more of uh um, there's even support for um, shipping, um, custom shipping logistics, for example, Shipwire. You can also integrate QuickBooks directly um, you know, into the WooCommerce. You can integrate uh, it with uh, MailChimp and Constant Contact so you can automatically sync up your customer's database with the, your uh, mailing list, which is very powerful um, and, uh, and very convenient for our clients you can even synchronize the inventory between Amazon uh, eBay and so forth um, you can have um, uh, deals of the day products of the day uh, related products and I mean there's just a whole host of of premium extensions and things that you can do as far as e-commerce logistics for your website and also as you uh, um, you as your business grows and as your website scales So some of the common questions that our clients uh, have had uh, for us with WooCommerce, um, one of the uh, uh, first questions that they ask is, will WooCommerce limit uh, me on how our website looks and uh, the look and feel of the website? Uh, no. What we do with our uh, websites is that first we'll uh, create the design comp for our clients, and once they approve of the design comp or design mock-up, um, it doesn't matter what e-commerce uh, software that our clients uh, want us to use, although we recommend uh, right now uh, WooCommerce. Um, and the reason for this is because WooCommerce and any other kind of e-commerce platform, that's just the engine behind it. So the actual design of the website is uh, separate in, and independent of it. The only pages that I would say will be affected would be the checkout um, pages, uh, the cart page, as well as uh, the My Account pages. Uh, and in this case, WooCommerce has done a fantastic job, so that's not something that you, you know, need to uh, worry about. Um, the only uh, time I would say it would have an impact uh, is if you're starting out and you're using a theme or template, which uh, for established businesses would really discourage it. And the reason for that is even the really good looking themes, it's made a, a theme or a template by its nature is designed to be generic. So that way um, it can be adapted to different businesses. And from just over the years, what I've seen is any kind of theme or template um, after all of the images, verbiage, and that kind of stuff is swapped out, there's a lot of unnecessary white space, issues with the margins, um, padding, typography, um, as well as uh, um, when you swap out all this information, a lot of the elements are not in its most optimal position, including the call to actions, as well as uh, phone numbers, that kind of stuff. And what that ultimately does is that it has negative impact on the presentation, as well as directly having negative impact on your sales conversions. Um, so people are more likely to leave your website as opposed to, uh, to checking out and purchasing something. And on the note with presentation, um, you know, and some business owners uh, debate about this, but whether, you know, from my point of view, whether you um, believe it or not, presentation does have a huge uh, impact uh, on both uh, 
the sales conversions, uh, the trust that your audience has uh, with your brand, um, as well as having an impact on the uh, price point that you're able to command. For example, um, a cupcake store uh, that has uh, the interior uh, designed by an interior designer with very modern, chic, contemporary furniture and furnishings, um, they're able to uh, sell cupcakes at the price of like seven ninety nine, uh, and they sell out. Versus the mom and pops uh, sweet store, they're selling at one ninety nine, two ninety nine, and they're selling a lot less. Um, and this is especially true if you're sell uh, in uh, selling any kind of lifestyle product, uh, clothing. Um, high-end uh, accessories, high-end furniture, any of this kind of stuff, um, presentation has a huge impact and direct correlation uh, to uh, sales as well as uh, conversions um, and also the price point that you're able to, uh, to command. Um, the second question uh, I think that we get a lot is um, you know, with the premium extensions, Am I able to uh, uh, upgrade and add this on at a later time? Absolutely. In fact, um, there's the amount of work between having the extensions installed and, and uh, set up right after the website's built versus later down the road. Uh, generally speaking, it's not any less or more um, in terms of the amount of work. Um, the other question that uh, we also get is, um, is WooCommerce uh, scalable? Can I scale my business using WooCommerce? Uh, absolutely. Um, as a matter of fact, we actually have clients that have thousands of products on their carts and also processing over half a million dollars in revenue a year uh, using uh, WooCommerce. Now, one of the things about uh, scalability is that a lot more of it has to do with the web hosting than the actual uh, e-commerce um, you know, software that you're using. For example, uh, as a business grows, they'll eventually grow out of um, of shared web hosting, so they'll need a VPS or virtual private server, and as it grows bigger, a dedicated server or many servers with a load balancing. But once that point comes, and it's a really nice uh, position to be in, uh, we'll help facilitate, or for our clients, we'll help facilitate and make sure that happens, and we've worked with clients that have gone through um, uh, you know, that point in the business where they did need to scale. Um, but generally, that's not an issue at all, and WooCommerce is not an issue when comes to uh, scalability. And the last common question that we get is, um, is WooCommerce secure? Um, and my answer for that is that it's no more or less secure than many of the other major e-commerce softwares out there. As long as um, you have SSL uh, installed, which basically encrypts your customer information and also your customer's billing information, uh, make sure you have uh, secure passwords uh, for all the logins you're not you're sharing that or having that you know widely open to uh, um, to people and make sure that the software is, is up to date um, with all of the latest security patches and updates um, if all those are uh, you yeah, are done then uh, you should be fine as far as you having your you yeah, website secure all in all, WooCommerce is a fantastic uh, e-commerce software, and in my professional opinion, I would say for 90% or if not more of business owners, this is probably the right uh, cart for you. And uh, right now, at the time of this video, I would say uh, from all the carts that I've used, hands down, um, this is the best one right now. Um, so hopefully you found my video uh, helpful, and if you have, uh, make sure you like this video, subscribe, feel free to post a comment below. And make sure you go to my uh, blog, yanhuang.me. Go ahead and like me on Facebook, please. Um, follow me on um, Instagram, Twitter, Google+. Uh, and also make sure you subscribe to my mailing list because I provide a lot of insight there, especially if you're a, uh, a business owner that I don't provide anywhere else. And also occasionally we do provide discounts on our web design development services as well. Um, and also, if you're a business owner and you're looking to have an e-commerce uh, website built for you, um, go ahead and check out my uh, company's website, grayhatweb.com. Um, we do, obviously this is biased, but we do fantastic work. And if you go to our website, check out our, our work. Um, I think our work uh, speaks uh, for itself. Um, and also, if you have any questions, want to get started, feel free to uh, reach out to me. 
Um, and other than that, um, thank you very much for watching this video and thank you um, for subscribing.